What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, <clears throat> so let's get into this tea. Now we're about to get into Krishan last night. Oh, no, man. She went out last night to French Montana's party. First of all, that party was lit. I showed y'all she went and got her tooth done before the party. You know, JB, everywhere she at, that's her That's her uh, friend or whatever. Now, I don't know if that's Lemmy beside her. No, that ain't Lemmy. That's her, um, the guy that be with her, the manager or whatever. So last night, Krishan went to that party, and apparently she was with her little boo, the little other boo. Um, this her performing. Space, he okay, y'all know it's a copyright with that too. Now Natalie was in there as well. As y'all can see, this is um Scotty. Natalie was over there with her. Natalie was over there with Scotty. Krishan was not speaking to Natalie or Lemmy, but I'm gonna show y'all that in a minute. But this is Krishan doing her thing. Now y'all know with sound, it gets a it's a copyright, so y'all will not hear no sound. Um, but anyhow. That's what Krishan was doing last night. I want to show y'all um, her with the other guy. Shout out to all these T-pages uh, on Instagram. You know, they get the point. All right, so this is also Krishan. This is when she just got in there. Now, that stomach ain't looking. That stomach is not looking flat how I was looking the last time. Mind you, if her and Blueface is going on three, four day hiatus, that means that's probably he coming at her eight times a day. Okay, so she gonna be pregnant in a minute if she yeah, ain't man, pregnant. Wicked man, she is, they look, she no blue pregnant. face, the real face. Uh, she don't it. know what he's saying, but yeah. But I mean, Jamaica, man, to be a Jamaica to be exact. Jamaica. Uh, 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 that is it. Oh shit, I missed it. I missed it. Damn, I will have to go back to that. But before we go back to that, I want to show y'all one more thing. Cause I know y'all like girl. This is Krishan up in French Montana face last night. Look at them eyes. Let me get y'all closer. Girl, look. We gotta start it over. Look at them eyes. <laughs> I think she said I always wanted to meet you. Hold on. I think she said, you know, I always wanted to meet you. Girl, Krishan flipping that hair all up in his face is given. It ain't supposed to because, you know, French Montana grown ass man. Um, I don't even think I would hope that he wouldn't go there. However, he was out outside with Ruby Rose. Ruby and, and uh, Krishan about the same damn age. Bro, they grown too. You know what I'm saying? They can do what it is that they please. But I just wanted y'all to know that. Also, Krishan was standing beside one of her little boo things. Um, it, this is alleged. I don't know uh, if, if it's a boo thing or not. But I got to show y'all. All right, so y'all, this is allegedly the boo. Um, he, You know, that's Krishan type right there. Now, I don't know if this was the guy who was blood clot, Ross clot, looking at her and, you know what I'm saying, she was doing what she was doing. I could be absolutely wrong. Y'all let me know down in the comment section, but Krishan was having a, a time. Do you hear me? And this is Adam 22, creep ass, filming her. I thought you didn't like her, baby. Okay. Um, let, me, let me get the next one. Okay, this is the one where that guy was talking to her. Now, this is another one. Sis was outside, you and me, having a time. But this dude was with her the whole time. Now, that could very much be her shooter. He might be her shooter. You get what I'm saying? Everybody got to have a shooter around him. And he looked like one. I ain't going to go. Okay. Happy birthday, dear oh, Why were they saying it so slow? Happy birthday. <laughs> They was having a time. Okay, so you know she gonna perform her diss song everywhere. I don't know if uh, French Montana paid her to do this, but yeah, I just wanted to let y'all know. Uh, Krishan was outside last night having a time, girl. 
Um, Natalie wasn't feeling the whole performance or whatever. I'm going to show y'all her tweets in a minute with her hating ass. Um, but I think we are done here. Okay, with <laughs> Okay, I guess they went to the strip club afterwards. Kashana, they're throwing money. Period. Period. Okay. And it's the last one. Um, she was outside twerking on Reekin the Menace. All right. Reekin the Menace was already she's pregnant. You know what I'm saying? She's showing love to her or whatever. Because y'all already know Krishana's probably pregnant again. But anyway, that's what happened with that. Now I have to show y'all. Natalie and her receipts with her hating ass because she uh, was feeling some type of way about something or Krishan not speaking. I don't know. Give me a second. All right, y'all. So this is Natalie. Um, she said, oh, oh, oops or whoops, whatever. Let me not be rude. Happy birthday, French Montana. I want to acknowledge, smile, nor be nice. Your song cute, but I like Barbie better. Have a good night, sweetheart. Um, then she said, you mean my show, LOL girl, go around this, my ish, uh, don't get on no live and say, I want this and that and the other on that show. Um, let's be honest. Yeah. That's what Natalie had to say last night. I'm going to go to Krishan's Twitter to see why Natalie was talking to herself. <laughs> Cause maybe she was talking to Krishan. I don't know. Krishan is reposting PD on Twitter. I mean, all you see is Krishan post a PD on Twitter. So I don't know who Natalie thought she was talking to. Y'all let me know what you think down in the comment section about that. All right, y'all. So let's get into Kiki Palmer. Now, first of all, I do not, um, I do not condone domestic violence at all. Uh, we've all been in our domesticated situations, um, but certain things just should not happen, especially with men and women. Um, and I'm gonna just put that there. Now, I know I always say if a woman put their hands on a man, you know, he has the right to, uh, defend himself. I still stand by that. I don't know if, uh, Kiki Palmer hit him first or, or whatever, but it was said that, uh, Kiki Palmer filed for full custody for her, her seed, um, the other day, I think it was November 5th or something like that. I could be wrong on a date, but she did it, you know, not too long ago. And, uh, you know, she came out and she had that to say, not, she didn't come out and say anything. It was reported. So after that, um, her baby father, he tweeted out and he said that, um, you know, I love you son. See you soon. Okay. Now Kiki Palmer, uh, she filed a order against him as well claims that he abused her multiple times over the course of their two-year relationship and is actually an article on it as well y'all and i'm gonna read that article in a minute but i did want to um just give y'all the breakdown of what happened initially and like why we are where we are you know today or whatever so this this just came out of the blue to be honest with you everybody was chilling boom kiki palmer comes out and wants full custody right after that, after the baby daddy said, love you, son, see you soon. Boom. She comes out with the in order situation as well. Um, at least the blogs posted that. Uh, so after that, her, his brother decides to jump in. Uh, his name is Serenus, Serenus, whatever. He's in a couple movies. Um, who even knew that this, this was his brother, but anyway, uh, posting the lease, a tweet seemingly addressing the in order, the most disgusting, vile, abusive, manipulative person I've ever encountered in my life. Um, <clears throat> abuses almost everyone. Y'all will see just send positive energy to the baby. Any child in the middle of something like this does not deserve it at all. Wow. So damn sad. So he was on his brother's side. So everybody was convinced like, okay, well, I guess uh that didn't happen so mama came out as well this, i've been in this, this business is, for 22 years. this is mama kiki palmer years i've seen a lot of stuff but this is this is i i can't help myself for sharonis jackson Sharonis to post on his twitter That's his name. Uh, uh the ridiculous stuff that he's posted when he knew his brother was a I went to Sharonis over a year ago and told him that his brother was abusive to my daughter. And he 
said, uh, well, I used to be like that too. What? Oh. So now he's posting on Twitter like he's this uh, special guy. We, we know he's the biggest f boy in Hollywood. Ooh. He's disrespectful to women, just like his little brother. Ooh. He taught his brother how to be a So he don't get to act like he's this special guy. No, you're a f boy oh. and you're a part of the problem. Wait a minute. I didn't see this last night. Okay. So that was after that was said. Now, the brother uh, did respond to that as well, um, which I have to find it. Before the brother responded, girl, we had pictures, and these are still pictures from a video of him, um, you know, allegedly. Well, this ain't alleged. That's him. Uh, you know, abuse, whatever. So, you know, he got on the ground, started on the couch. Um, and this is another picture of him being on the ground. This is another uh, photo of them being on the um, stairs. Uh, and it was a couple more photos, you know, running around. But basically all of them were the same. Um, he was putting his hands on that woman, uh, a.k.a. that woman is Kiki Palmer. Okay. Now, I don't know why he did that shit and thought he was going to get away with that. Like, I don't I'll never understand that. But anyway. Uh, Kiki Palmer granted, she was granted the custody and granted the in order, uh, and it's temporary. Obviously y'all know they have to go to court, um, for this as well. So yes, the brother also, he came out and I don't see his tweet right now. He actually responded in, um, I don't know if it was the shade room or the neighborhood talk, but he ended up responding in, uh, one of these platforms. And he basically was saying, that it was cap. Um, uh, and he, 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 he said that it was cap and that the mom never spoke to him as in Kiki Palmer's mom never spoke to him about the whole abuse situation. So he was trying to say that the mom was lying. Now, uh, since Kiki Palmer came out, Saronis baby mama, <laughs> she put on her, uh, story laughing about, this situation like it's like a movie to her because i'm sure he was abusing her Look, as I well mean, so this was after the mom's um response now if he if saronis or whatever the hell that boy name is decide to come out and say something else then sis gonna have some receipts somewhere and he might want to shut the hell up okay now i'm sorry we i had to break that down to y'all like that i hope i did a good job y'all know i'm new to this not true to this okay so i'm getting into this type of content especially with celebrities it be so much to keep up with bro but we gonna keep up i ain't complaining okay because god is great also uh last thing uh saucy santana said so apparently y'all want me to fight kiki baby daddy okay because y'all know saucy santana has been taken up for the ladies in the uh in the industry okay so <sighs> I want to know what y'all think about that down in the comment section below. I really don't have anything to say yet because I really want Kiki to come out and say something. However, what I will say is y'all better learn to protect y'all selves. This is all I got. I mean, I know granted these men be coming out of nowhere with it, but a lot of times they do it all the time. You know what I'm saying? It's like, you know, it's coming. It's like, you know, the nature of what's going on. But as Kiki Palmer, maybe she was like, I can't, you know, Maybe she don't want to, you know what I'm saying? Like, use that chitty chitty on him. Because, you know, she's, she got a, I mean, come on, she got a lot to lose. It's a lot. This is a lot. I don't have much to say. I want to know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I just want to say, though, always protect yourselves at all times. I don't give a damn if you got to break anything. Break everything uh, to protect yourself. And um, I get it. They strong. I get it. This is just a lot. But I just wish women would be a little more vigilant out here and just stop trusting, you know, just because he your baby daddy don't mean you got you can trust him like they I feel like baby daddies are the most dangerous species on this earth. But also so are baby mamas There's some baby mamas out here that will hurt their baby daddy There's some baby daddies out here that will really hurt their baby mama. So, you know, that's really all I got. I want to know what y'all think down in the comment section below. Uh, we done with this video. Love you. I appreciate y'all. Yeah. Yeah.